Yeah, Madison, for those of you who have had a vaccine, you know, it's pretty quick. It's just one shot and you're done. But for those, the few of you who are under a trial, it's a lengthy process. You have to get your vitals taken. You have paperwork. And for the Pfizer booster trial that started this week, it's happening right behind these doors. I got a call yesterday um, offering it and I was more than excited to say yes. Nicolette is one of the first patients in the nation to receive a trial dose of the Pfizer booster shot, but this isn't her first vaccine trial. Since I was at the original study, I know what to expect and, you know, I've been down that rodeo. The booster trial started this week for 60 of 225 original patients that received the Pfizer shot during its trial last year at UC Davis School of Medicine. And these people were all in the original trial, so they've been followed all along the way. So this is additional information to say, okay, now they're here to get their booster. UC Davis is one of 150 sites across the country doing these trials. The data that we're doing get rolls up all into 150 sites. Uh, the Pfizer has 150 sites and that information then gets all put together and then goes and is shared with the FDA and other agencies. It's the same process that led to the approval of the Pfizer vaccine for emergency use. So they're tracking the antibody levels. Now the CDC and federal government will use this data to decide about booster shots. Everybody who's around me, just we're, I'm just trying to help them be safe as well as, you know, myself. And that every shot is a dose of hope. Now, UC Davis Health said that they were chosen to be a part of this trial because they have a really diverse population of trial participants.